Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on Western Wilds. Woo! Your host, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, you're probably wondering why there's two tractors here with plows on them. Been doing a lot of plowing. So we got pretty much the same one we had before. We just have two of them now. And we're using the uh, 8RX 410 series. And we're using the case. Uh, I believe this is the case Magnum. Yep. AFS series 400. And uh, yeah, Mr. Yankee and Colin Julian. I've uh, been doing pretty good. And I ran soil samples back behind them. Now, I'm sorry y'all didn't see that, but that's why we're low on money. That and we paid some on the loan. Um, we're gonna go in here, show y'all some things. Um, this is what the map looks like now. I went ahead and replowed all this, and this is what I plowed. Uh, we already had a field here, but I plowed all this that's in this blue outline here. It was uh, new, so we plowed it up, and uh, I went ahead and, of course, had uh, the other. I had Mr. Yankee on one end, Colin and Julian on the other, and one started here, and Eden started up here, and they met in the middle over here, and they went over here to finish this up. And as you can see, this is where the sheets were at right here. And you probably see this little area going over to here. This is a sawmill. Um, I'm going to go ahead and then try to cut these trees out around through here, and just make this a feel for now but it will be replanted in grass so we can mow it for I'm thinking about trying cows but yeah that's the soil types that's the pH that is the nitrogen so as you can see we gotta get started on lime and stuff like that and um yeah that's the uh, yield we got from last year so it wasn't too bad and that's the seed rate and you see the green is the uh loam so we got quite a bit of loam so our seed rate should be in the low for most areas so yeah that's that and that's what it looks like now but this blue line the outline of this blue line and stuff is the course play and i need to find a way to delete that course so and we go down here we can't plant nothing right now so for nothing we can't plant nothing not even grass okay so we're good for a little bit this is what the weather looks like um, today pretty good but the second is start calling for snow uh, same thing in February the February 1st nothing but second day in February is snow and it looks like uh, March and April is gonna be nothing but rain because uh, that's the stats you know train yard usually the best place to get everything um, we do have some honey but oh, we really don't have that much to sell and if we go down to honey um oh we got sellage um sellage is farmer's market 427 and february is the best time to do it 212 oh wrong button 427 at farmer's market is what we get for it so um but ours is gonna be at the bga plant I might have got a truck and try that. Actually, I need to look for methane gas. 449, 427, 449 seems like the best place to go. Selling station plan. Uh, I need, oop, I need to mark that. 449 and see where that's going to be at. Um, but we'll go back over here. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, yeah. Honey, 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 honey. Of course, train yard, best price. And going up, good. But, uh, oh, yep, there's our mark, okay. I see that, I see that. Where's that flashing at? It looks like it's flashing over at the BG. Hey, let's go to Big Map real quick. That's it right there. <laughs> Let me click on it. Okay, so best place is right there. Uh, visit. But this is where we get at, I thought. I don't understand. Because there's a station here. 
Oh, that's the electric one. Is it? Oh. Green, green too. Yeah, EV, that's the electric station there. And then this here is where we get it from to load the truck. Hmm. But that's what it says, methane station. Oh well, but anyway. We gotta go into midnight here so y'all can see what it brings at midnight and uh, let's get up at seven o'clock and we'll sleep all right six eight three three long interest 30 or 385 vehicle leasing cost thousand well y'all probably see that I'll hold it a little bit longer so we see it but that was at midnight and it's next morning and it's still dark all right I will see y'all when uh I'm going to get these two tractors unhooked and stuff. And uh, we're going to get some other things on them. Probably spread some lime too. Anyway, I will be right back. Alright, it's a little bit more daylight down here. So we're going to go ahead and uncover this pit. Um, open silo, yes. And then uh, must turn these conveyor belts on and get this started before we go any further. Start engine. Um, okay, it won't let me in. Did I start them for all of them? Back on up. There we go. Um, okay. They're all started. Turn on conveyor belt. Okay. Turn that known. Turn that on. Okay, you can see the silo there disappearing. There on the corner. And it's filling that up, so that is good. We are doing good now. Yeah, it's moving from this corner here. You can see it. I ain't getting no, well, it's doing it from that. And, uh, I need, uh, I can get in here, turn this, uh, no. Turned the, the belt on, but I didn't turn the uh, turn off conveyor belt. No, that's on. Uh, they're all on. Okay, good. I just uh, it'll catch up eventually, probably. If not, we'll move it around. Oh, why is it doing that? I don't like that. Open silo completely. <gasps> What? Compacting 100% fill level chaff blanket silo. Oh my. They wasn't already. Y'all seen that, right? Troubles with the silo. Oh no. It's still. No space capacity for silage, okay? Yeah, I forgot this belt runs faster than this thing can process. Still showing silage going in. Methane's at 13, which that will sell. We just gotta keep an eye on our stuff up there. Okay, I will be back in a little bit, folks. It gets a little bit lighter. All right, folks, I can't mess around no more. It's calling for rain or snow up there. It looks like snow. And uh, as you can see, we're putting out the white stuff. No, not that white stuff. Lime. We're putting out lime. And uh, we got a, a good distance throw on this spreader, too. Um. I'm putting the lime down first, as you can see here on the right, it's a little bit different texture than the left. And I started picking up rocks, and we don't want to do that. We want to put the lime down first, and not to run in a ditch. Um, one, after we get done putting the lime down, we can come back with the rock picker, pick up all the rocks, 
it will cultivate it for us then we'll put down our fertilize and you know either way it's going to make it work in just right using the rock picker it'll kind of like cultivate the lime into the soil and stuff so we got that going for us and as you can see this might not take very long I think I'm gonna put on a worker for this away because uh, yeah it's a it, it's a wide width um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and go in here control s go to the little snake thing gear hit that to reverse it back up and voila of course we're going to have to change that just a little be all in page down to make it go the way we want all right right there and what we're going to do i'm just going to hook on for a little bit and then i'm going to back up and that's going to get me straight for a worker and I'm turning GPS off and then hire a worker oh we don't have enough money okay we're, we're going to fix that real quick uh, let's tab around here got everything a mess here's our rock picker got it going let's go ahead and no that won't work either <sighs> I'm like, well, we'll go ahead and turn the rock picker on. And you see how it's doing. Not going to pick up very many rocks because I've already been over this, but it's working the lime into the ground. Alright, I'm going to stop right there because, see, can't hire a worker. Shut that off. And I don't know why the silo done that. Alright. It's 7.56, so this place is open. We're going to sell some straw. Let's see. Take our straps off of that and switch back to the back. And we're going to take our straps off of that. And, and then we're going to ease on across here. Uh-oh. Man. Okay. That one's too high, so. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? Oh, man. That was $13,592 plus 201 environmental school penalty. Oh, we're making a penalty now. There we go. $5 penalty. On 388. Well, we we are in there. We can hire some workers now. Um, I'm just gonna pull this over right here out of the way, and we're gonna magically transport. Do 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 do. Oh, yep. We need to sell. The, well, we ain't selling. We'll do that later. But uh, yeah, it's a Bushmobile. <laughs> Actually, let me pull up there and uh, see what I can make disappear real quick. Uh oh, and it's this one right here. Uh, not quite full, but oh, why ain't you? Oh, you're not in this marker, huh? I gotta back up and get over. It started falling on me after I unstrap it to put another one on, and then it was like a nightmare after that, folks. So that's why it looks all bad. Can I squeeze in here. Oh, come on. Oh yeah. Still not quite full. Can I pull this truck over closer? Oh yeah. Okay. This one's unloaded. Also created a mess. 
Sometimes I gotta hit E on the keyboard to get back in. I don't know why it's like that, but oh well. Alright, now I gotta skip the truck over. Um, not the most happiest place. Alright, let's see what that will sell real quick. on up in here come on oh y'all thought this was gonna be realistic <laughs> I need to make a I need to make a daggering series where I'm super realistic okay so this one's this one's good for a while and they're still making making furniture and these are almost 10 liters from being 4,000 and I think I picked them up and sold them last time but we're doing good now I'm gonna take this truck on back and see if I dropped any because it was night time when I brought it up here you can still see my tracks kinda and uh, yeah I just brought it up this way and went back across that way and we're going to get some tractors rolling and, uh, yeah, be back in a second and we'll start those tractors up. All right. Don't look like I missed any. I took the bulldozer over here and pushed all of them up over here. So we're good to go there. I'm wanting to push this on out or cut this field on up to this side right here where this one lines up. And go straight out that way but we're gonna put a road in that goes down inside those trees over there and back over to our other sawmill in town over there um, oh, oh, oh I forgot I can't go in this way can't go in this way gotta go this way I want to show y'all what we're gonna be working on next when we get the money uh, 54,000 I wish I had about another 30 or 40,000 go to that I would buy an extra lot of land but this is going to be our next little area we work on because we're also going to build a road uh, probably have to come out on this side down through here and probably going that way or that diagonal over that way I think something like that or it just might turn to go that way but we already got one going that way, so probably just gonna go straight that way. All right, shut that off. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get this guy started. Let's back up. Uh, we're gonna get him started long enough to start the oven. No field found. There we go. All right, I want to tab. Do the tab game. We gotta sell a couple things. I want to see. I know this one probably not going to hire a worker off hand until I make a round. So let's make a round. And this thing goes pretty fast. And this is a, a special rock picker. Um, can't remember who it's by, but it's the. Uh, now let me get turned around here and I'll show you. Okay, pick her up, turn, lock GPS back on, let her down, hit cruise, go in here real quick, and that was the wrong one, but I'm glad it saved though. Let's go in this and go down to our own vehicles, and where is, oh right here, stone pickers, come on. And it's that right there, Scorpio XL. And you look that up and you'll find it. Um, it's 9 meters, 100 horsepower. Um, forgot how. No, I don't want to sell it. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oof. That was lucky. All oh, this tractor going to be all white. All right. Lay her down. 
think I did across the end too, but I can't remember. We'll find out here in a minute. We're gonna make it all brown again before we get done. All right, back to our other one real quick. Oh, it stopped right here. Start her back up. Oh, get the guardrail too. Ooh, glad we wasn't stuck. All right, yeah, the road's gonna be down through there. Uh, I can't find a way to delete that car, so we're gonna make the road probably go this way and come in here. So, yeah. Hear that or come out this way. Don't know for sure yet, so. All right, hire a worker. And, uh, what are you doing? Oh, hire a worker. I had GPS locked on it didn't do it it just basically came to a stop let's look at our map real quick zoom out here so we can see our workers I want to go to G, uh, not GPS but precision farming and you can see our pH is doing pretty good uh, it's taking the yellow away I like that okay that is good and Looks like our rock picker stopped. We just gotta get nitrogen down after this. Oh, I'm out. I'm out of line. Okay, let's go do that real quick. Hang on just a second. All right. I hate that battle silo. We're gonna have to wait another month or two. That was terrible. But we still got like four million dollars and something to uh oh man that truck's in the way gps keeps on locking on let's see if we can get close enough sorry folks gonna have to push out of the way um why is this not working because there ain't no lime in it and it's not activated out of space why is it out of space um we can upgrade the factory um level two for 33 yes that is a new mod too folks it holds and that was supposed to be oh we ain't got no stones yet that's why wait what what is that that's gold production what happened to Lime, okay, out of space. It's activated. It's got stones. It's got water. Maybe because the. Oh, let's unrealistically push this back. And it's showing empty. Hmm. Why is it saying out of space? That's what I don't understand. Why is it doing that? It's going straight through it. Or straight to it. Change output. Spawning. Selling. Distributing. Storing. We, we want it on store, right? Uh, upgrade. Not enough money. Hmm. I don't know folks. We're out of we're out of line right now, so Oh and this guy went back where we went. Can't be happening that. Alright, it's already thirty minutes in and I'm gonna get some of this done. Oh, I did hit it. At least we got to start on that field to do after we get this. And I think this thing holds like 10,000 liters. I think that's what I got it set on. And it, it's picking them up. So probably get this right here done over to the fence, the telephone poles. And then I'll make a through down there, empty out into the line production 
so we don't have to buy none. Um, get the water trailer up there and we'll go from there. So I'll see you here in a minute. Alright folks. As you can see, we have it back. I went to a backup save game. But it's still doing this. It says open silo completely. I'm not going to do that until I get all of this here gone. And then I'll open this silo up. Not going to make that mistake again. But it, it's still going as you can see. But it's not moving very fast because we're maxed out on silage. Methane's getting on up there. Dyes their states a long ways from being full. Uh, but 50,000 on methane and that'll be done. Uh, I am running time slow. Just because uh, we got a lot to do. Um, like I said, some of the things not might, might not be the same. Because I had to redo the save game folder. So, but. I don't know what's causing that to do that. I don't know if this will fix it or not. But what I had to do. Oh, uh, it's take a mod out and that mod is the upgradable factories mod I think what it is um, maybe Alien Jim hasn't done an update or something on this map I don't know for sure now so don't hold it to me um, but I took the upgradable factories thing out and then we have lime now and get right there and boom I'm gonna stop it real quick go in here and you see how much I took out and I'll show you here look you no know, water still shown it's shown we are out of stones now I went back on the save game and looked at or not the game but the recording I done when it had missing materials our materials missing it didn't show what all of this was white even this thousand here was white so it's a little bit different I'm gonna show you I'm gonna buy a little a uh, hundred dollars for a thousand stones it'll pop up here in a second see there it goes and now this is gone this is running and we got 40,000 liters of lime plus what we just took out so this thing is working as you can see it is going down. It's 864, 808. Our water's going to be staying up there because I turned on the automatic irrigation system that I got installed. That circle works good. Now let's get this filled up. I can't remember how much we can hold. But it looked like it's going. Oh, you can see the gauge over uh, back behind the spreader there on that green thing, the auger pipe going down pretty good too. Yeah, I'll get out so you can see it. It's right here. That is neat. Alright, maybe when we'll come back. We'll tarp that. See, we need an outlet on this end. This place is completely sealed. You have to go down here in order to get out. Come on, open up. There we go. Uh, I do have uh, somebody running the uh, the rock picker, stone picker, or whatever it's called. Let's see, I'm going up this way. Whoa, almost went that way. Alright, uh, lock on. Get my speed up here and turn on and as you see yeah this is what I got plowed up already now I'm wanting to buy this section right here in the grass area and you can see it looks like an L shape there where I plowed goes over to a sawmill here I'll go on here and show y'all now I don't know if it's gonna make our chickens work or not you know they should be showing eggs by now and they're not it might be because of the food I have no idea but I don't know what's causing that but the uh, upgrade wool factories mod did cause the uh, lime thing not to work 
because I removed it and I went back in and it started working. So I'm like, woohoo! But anyway, this is going to be kind of long, so I'm going to bring you back here in a, in a few minutes. So I'll be right back. I want to bring you back. We can see it right there where it just disappeared, but we still got soybeans in the field or canola. That's one or the other. We got to get that out pretty soon before it becomes planting season. Yeah, I just want to show y'all that and I'm getting pretty low on lime here and I want to do that side over there real quick. Well, I have enough. No, I'm not going to have enough. Right, I'm just going to have to stop the other tractor real quick. I might have a time to go get enough and go get another load and come back. I'm going to keep an eye on them. They get close to that uh, one end there. I'll have to stop them. If it wasn't for this gate, we'd be alright. I'm a right, let me go ahead and switch over real quick. Whoa. Oh, that's going too fast or what? We're leaving tracks here for a minute. Oh, this tractor's almost getting low on fuel. I'm going to stop it right there. Ooh, tried to stop and couldn't. Uh, we have uh, 11,185 looks like stones in here. And we're going to go on keep putting in for stone right now. I mean, <laughs> put the stones in the stones. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. We're going to put the stones in the lime production because it'll help us on that part. My door is open. Shut my door. Huh. Man, this tractor needs a bath. All right, I'm gonna have to do some trading here. All right, that's full. Put this guy on over here because we gotta keep this guy here going first because he's the slowest right now. I'm gonna hit the pipe, am I? Oh, no, perfect. All right, show y'all the dumping of the stones here. Okay, pull off the scale thing there and I'm going to go and check real quick to see what that, oh not very much. Alright, we're down to 13,000. Yeah, we're going to keep the stone picker going. Let's get it back out to the field. Alright folks, but that's basically what I'm going to be doing. Um, I don't want to conserve y'all time too much on that and y'all already seen other folks do it and you know all about it and all that good stuff uh, yeah we're, we're just going to keep doing this uh, BGA still going to uh, the conveyor belts done stop so that's good we, um, wait a minute well it's probably full uh, it's probably out I don't know what I'm thinking um, I didn't set the what you make call it on this the GPS because just going to use a worker go down up and down this way so that's what I'm going to do here overlap this a little bit I have to catch them at the far end but there he goes I'll keep an eye on him make sure he turns the right way um on this here I'm going to detach the back one we're going to probably, oh, it stopped, that's why. No, just... oh, start engine. Turn conveyor belts on. Oh, for forgot, I, I bet you that one right there is picking it up. 
Okay, well, I'm gonna have to redo this. Oh, there. They started. Let's see if we can get back up here. I opened some more up on the thing there. Okay, well, we're gonna let that run then. Uh, we got a tab around. Um, I'm gonna hit R. We got some more bales here we need to sell. Probably gonna have to stack some. R. Uh. Come on, back up right. I forgot these won't stack three, they only go too high. I don't know how that one actually worked. I'm gonna restack them until I get the rest of these on there. I'll do that off screen. And let's get around to that one tractor, can we? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh good, he turned the right way. Good deal. Yeah, er. We are full, and our math thing's almost full. It should sell on the IRO. Let's speed time up, see if... Let's go in here and see if we got selling first. Uh, yeah, methane is selling. That's probably why it's not done, because it's full. I'm going to speed time up here. Till 9 o'clock. Any minute now. All right, we got fifty-one thousand and it sold eighty thousand worth. Okay, I'm gonna keep that about three zero. -oh. So that's pretty good. Uh, I don't know how much that was. Let's go into our thing here. Um, where's our stat set that tells us what we sold? Is it here? A vehicle. Um, property income, no, let's see if we got, uh, biogas plant income, is it that? That'd be more than that. Property maintenance, vehicle running costs, new vehicles, sold buildings, property income, production costs, uh, wood, bales, wool, milk, sold products. I don't know what that was, but $439,000 worth in January. I ain't just February? Oh, January 2nd. Okay, January 2nd. Biogas plant income is only 9000 That has to be it. Yeah, okay, $9,000. That's just for a meth thing. I'm going to have to check on that, but i got to get a tractor going real quick. Where is that tractor, is it? Yep. That is fertilizer, okay. Not fertilizer, but lime. We got lime in here. I might do that again and see if I can... I'll keep track on the, uh, the actual payment when it comes 10 o'clock and then uh, go from there. sneak under here now the belt's back running again so that's good All right, I'm going to go ahead and get this finish big wide whiff and I'm missing some okay look like the tractor's doing okay yep as long as he's coming this way Alright folks, I guess what I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to go ahead and um, finish liming the heck out of this and, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to start right here. I bet these poles going to be in the way, y'all. Yep, they are. Just have to go around them and then probably, oh crap. <laughs> no, I can't go around them. 
Uh, how do I take down the whiff? I don't want to unload. Um, don't want to do that. Uh, deactivate. No, change working whiff. All uh, right. There we go. Let's see how wide that is. 15 meters might be enough. Oh yeah, perfect. That way I won't waste so much. But yeah, I want to thank each and every one of y'all folks. This is going to be a, probably a long one because Udden was 29 minutes and Harry is 17 minutes. I'm going to try to cut as much down as I can for y'all. But uh, I will bring y'all back. We'll be done with the lime. We'll be done with the rock picker. And, uh, oh yeah, I got it all almost. Um, and from there, we're just going to, I don't know, I'll bring you back when I think it's worth recording, I guess. Um, we got to get the loan paid off so we can get grain bin silo set up and all that. And I was hoping the, the sheets would start making you know eating and making wool so we can turn it into fabric and stuff but I guess it's not going to work so I, I don't know on that um, I'm going to try a cow shed now if we get the money that way we'll have milk and stuff like that let's see oh don't want to do that um this way there we go full swing I'm going to start easing this over Wrong way. All right. But folks, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all make me so happy with the comments and the likes and shares and stuff. Um, one thing I want to ask now is can y'all please uh, share me with your friends and get me up to a thousand subscribers or a thousand family members I should say because I want to I want to, I think if I get to a thousand family members subscribers that's what I call y'all family members because that's what y'all are I will try my best to start doing live streams if I can get to a thousand members uh, that way it uh, help me because you know I, I'm not working nowhere at all uh, I'm trying to get my disability and doing this helps me much more uh, I can do things around the house a little bit go live and you know, I got good internet now with Ritter and yeah it's just it's one of those things folks so if any way possible if y'all can please help me get to a thousand members and until then Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see you in the next video. Later.